Hi there, it's Mark from Teledyne ISCO and welcome back to our how to series. Today I'm going to show you how to use the auto prime feature, which is very useful if you're wanting to clean the system or if you wanted to change solvent systems. This could be if you're transferring from normal to reverse phase. So let's see how it works. To access the auto prime, we we'll click on tools and as you can see, we have the auto prime at the top. So what it's asking us to do is prime the fluids in order of decreasing solvent strength. However, we're wanting to prime the lines and the pumps with IPA. So what we need to do is insert all four solvent lines into a Winchester of IPA and then simply make sure in this table that all four solvent lines are selected. As we're using IPA, we know this already, it doesn't matter what the solvent names are as long as all four individual lines are selected. We then press play and the system will prime each solvent line with 50 mils of the solvent. Once the auto priming has been completed, it will give you this message to let you know. Simply press OK. We're then ready to reprime the pumps and the solvent lines with the solvent of choice. If we are moving from normal phase to reverse phase, we need to flush the system with immiscible solvent, such as IPA. And in order to flush the system, we go into tools and we select manual control. As you can see from this table, we have quite a lot of options that we can choose from. However, what's important to note is the flow path, and this directs where the IPA will run through. In order to flush the system fully, we choose through cartridge and column. As long as the, an IPA bottle is placed into solvent line one and two, this is fine. We then press pump 50% B, and it will push solvent through the system directly into the waste. Once this has been completed, the system has been fully primed with IPA and we're then ready to reprime with water and acetonitrile. This would be the same process for if you were wanting to switch back between reverse phase to normal phase. 